What's up, y'all? Are you a mad dog with 2020 vision? That's the question right now. But before we get into that, I'd like to say thank you to everybody who watched my first vlog. Uh, I got some pretty decent response back, and people who I didn't even know was watching YouTube actually told me they watched my vlogs. It was cool. So I really appreciate that. Um, if you are watching them, you know, please subscribe to the channel because subscribing to the channel it notifies you when I do upload new stuff. And you kind of, you know, keep in tack of, of when I do new projects. So definitely subscribe um, if you don't mind, you know. But thanks again for watching, y'all. All right, so are you a mad dog with 2020 vision? What is that all about? Well, I'll tell you what. Today is a very nice day here in Washington State. And I'm really just getting home about 30 minutes to go. So uh, we, from work, which is, is in Seattle, we catch the, the, the bus and take us to the park and ride. And from the park and ride, we drive to the crib. So we get to the park and ride. It's hot as hell. Uh, we get to the truck and somebody turned the heat on easy bake. It's like 98 degrees in this truck because they've been sitting in the direct sun. So we get in there like we got to stop by the store get something to drink because it's just too hot. So we go to the gas station. It's kind of like a 7-Eleven Circle K type store. I go in there and get me a 32 ounce of uh, Dr. Pepper with a lot of ice because that is the truth. Man, that is so good when it's bubbling your lip got that burn. You know what I'm talking about, right? All right. So I get my little drink, let's get her a drink. I turn around and I look down on the shelf. At the top, at the very bottom of the shelf. And guess what I see? When I first saw that, I was like, man, I haven't seen this in a long time, man. It's been a while. And when I first saw it, I automatically just went back to flashback. I was like, Lotto, Elise, Swatch Watches. Man, it brought back some good memories from back in the day. So you know what? I had to get one. I had to get it, y'all. And it was cheap, so I got it. So this is what I I got, I picked up. Now, you may have seen this on a regular basis, I don't know, but for me, I haven't seen this in a long time, especially not this one. Bam! Mad Dog 2020, Orange Jubilee. Now, I've seen the fruity stuff they've been around nowadays, the new stuff, but I haven't seen the Orange Jubilee in a very, very long time. So again, Mad, Mad Dog 2020. I know what you probably thinking now. Some of y'all acting real bougie right now saying, I know he ain't buy that cheap ass stuff. I wouldn't know you that cheap ass stuff. I drink the good stuff nowadays. You lie. You used to drink this back in the day and you know it. So don't pretend. So I got one and I'm going to drink this. Not all tonight, of course. I'm definitely going to give me a sip of it. I'll probably turn on some old school public enemy too while I do this. But, then stop there. Boom! I got two of them. They're only $4.98. I'm going to test it out. I had one so long. I'm so excited to taste this and see what it tastes like. I'll probably be dead after the first sip, but that's okay. It's fine. So, hey, so the question for y'all today is, what is some of your favorite old school drinks? When you go to the store, grocery store, you're in the wine section, or you're in the liquor store, what do you see there that reminds you of, dang, I remember back in the day, we just drink that. You don't buy it now. How I many of y'all actually really buy this now? Not the people who still buy this, but you don't buy it now. But when you see it, it automatically just clicks in your head like, man, I remember back in the day, we used to hit that all the time. So what are your favorite drinks? What are your favorite mixes that you should have back in the day? Leave a comment below and let me know, y'all, okay? So again, Mad Dog 2020, I'm going to hit this later on, you know what I'm saying? So again, thanks for watching, y'all. Please press the like button. Please share it. Give it a thumbs up. And subscribe. Subscribing is free. How much free stuff can you get nowadays? Nothing. Nothing free. But pressing that subscribe button, it is free. So definitely subscribe, y'all. I'm about to go and get my sip on this Mad Dog 2020. Well, what that bark? Mm -hmm. <laughs>